Sodor is surrounded by beautiful blue sea. It has fields of green and sandy yellow beaches. There are rivers, streams and lots of trees where the birds sleep. There are windmills and a coal mine and docks where visitors to the island arrive. The island also has lots and lots of railway lines. Who's that puffing down the track? It's Thomas. Hello, Thomas. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the island of Sodor. Slow down, James. A fat control of sentience love their work on the island of Sodor. Thomas likes running his branch line. Gordon likes pulling the express. And Percy likes taking the mail. The most important thing for the steam engines is coal. Without coal, all of the engines would ground to a halt. One day, Egbert puffed into the arm with trucks of coal. He had been working all night, and now he was very tired and covered in coal dust and coal bags. James and Gordon laughed. Look, Gordon, you know what's life? Every day there's a surprise. <laughs> but today, there's a moving sack of coal. <laughs> <laughs> Edward was cross. If you were shunting coal trucks, you'll be dirty. Of Edward crossly. James sniffed. Well, at least he doesn't smell at something. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, James, said Egbert. Course he doesn't smell, James, puffed Gong. Cole doesn't have a smell. <laughs> I know it doesn't, Gong, but he could get a wash down before coming to work. The engines have a reputation to keep up. <laughs> Even you, Gong, when you have that accident with something he wants before. Gong. At least one engine's already been working. We can see that. That's enough, James. Now listen closely, everyone. A new bridge has been built on the Citadel. And when it's built, I need an engine to test it. The engines were excited. James was sure he would be chosen. If I do my job quickly, I would really be the first engine to cross it and get it done. James? I've got a special job for you. I want you to take some cement to the bridge, then collect some soil from the bridge and take them to the landfill site with Percy. They're going to be very dirty nook. Now off you go. What? So you can't be serious. You know I hate dirty jobs. Damn it, it's my time off to spend the engine. Besides, why can't Toby or Packer do it? Yeah, well, do as you're told, James. As you know, really useful engines don't argue. <sighs> yes, sir, said James, and he puffed away. <laughs> Percy and Henry laughed. <laughs> Silly engine. Silly engine. Maybe laughed. But Henry wasn't laughing for long. Be careful, Henry, said James. You're not pulling the fine kipper today. Make sure you stay on the rails. I don't want you to get in my way. Oh, poor piece of coal in it, will you? Said Henry annoyed. James was starting to rush the other engines. 
If you keep starting like that, Henry, you'll end up being the slowest then on Fyodor. Later, James went to pick up the shops. The foreman told him that they need to be taken to the thrift site to pick up the soil. And Percy is coming to help you, he said. Percy arrived and buffered up to the chucks. Thomas puffed up. Be careful, he warned. It's a long way to that ford. Pah! I'll go on the head then, said James. Percy will just slow me down. Speed is on everything, you know. Even if you get there first, you can't do the work without my help. Of Percy. But James wasn't listening. He was thinking about being the first entrance across a new bridge. I'm all ready, of James. Come on, Percy. Let's scram. <laughs> hey, slow down, James. Oh dear, of Thomas. I think James is going to get himself into trouble sometime today. On the way, they stopped up to pick up the cement truck at the yards. Come on, Percy, Puff came. If we get there quick, then the bridge will be finished faster. Come along, slow coach. And they raced off. Slow coach, Percy of Crossley. James raced along. And Percy started fainting. Felt the rate on its buffer slacking. Up there. I mean, look up. There was Max, Monty, Lightning, and Mater playing the game called I Dare You to Tip Off a Fat. Basically, you spend the day tipping off things that others are daring to tip off. Monty Dare, Max. So, stand back and um, watch the fun. <laughs> Turn off the windshield wipers, they don't work, they're just making it worse. Soon, Kane was arrived at the building site. I'm here, he whistled. Where's Percy? Asked the foreman. He's slow. I raced ahead to get the stuff here. But Percy is supposed to help us build the bridge. Henry needs help getting up the hill, and the fort's harder for him to cross than you because it's very bumpy and mocky. You ought to go back for him. Oh man! We'll never get the bridge built! So James took off. He hadn't made it for a cement truck to be uncoupled. Something tells me that James is going to get himself into trouble, said the foreman.